From what I hear, this is the fastest thing out here, is it? Yeah. What? It's, yeah, it's, it's the fastest T-Rex out here, for it's sure. tell you I think it is you know you guys can let me know in the comment section below what you think but we seem to have found the world's most powerful most powerful and possibly quickest t-rex in the game right now is this one sitting behind me um, I let you guys be the judge I'm gonna introduce you to the owner and let him talk to you about it so Joe, you gotta you gotta introduce yourself to them, man. I know you. They don't yeah. know you. Uh, Joey Martinez from uh, you know I live between San Antonio and Austin, town called New Braunfels. Representing that Texas. Representing okay. that Texas, right here. Oh man. MK Designs. Do, ev do everything oh, man. myself. Oh, I got man. I had my friend Bud help me with the fabrication, the turbo setup, okay. and the motor, the tuning, and everything. So we're sitting about 400 horsepower total. From what I hear, this is the fastest thing out here, is it? Yeah. What? It's, yeah, it's, it's the fastest T-Rex out here. For it's, sure. def it's definitely got the most power. Yeah. I think what people want to know is if you can't put that power to the ground, is it fast? Yeah. What you got to say to the ones that say that? I mean, first and second, obviously, it ain't going to go to the ground. Yeah. But third, fourth, fifth, sixth, it's game on. If anybody wants to, for it'll, sure. get, it'll get to the ground. We had it at 168 GPS you know, on the highway. And okay. it, it'll, it'll, go, it'll go further, but you know. Yeah. Anybody else, they gotta line up to see. Yeah, definitely. Line yeah, up to line see. Up. Yeah, if you don't think this is the most powerful and fastest T-Rex in the game, my man, oh, and you see he's on air, remote air. If you don't think he has the most powerful setup in the game, he said line up and try. I think, man, people wanna know, what the hell made you go this extreme? Cause this, this got to be an intense ride, man. It was just like a rolling business car, like showing like what I can do. Like, I, you know, the customer cars I work on, you know, it's just, they're not local. They're from all over the country. So this right here is me, my name on it. Everything is, is me and my shop, you know, and I just, I want to do something crazy to kind of push the envelope so someone else could do the same and, and do something better as well, you know? Everything I build, my own personal stuff, I drive the shit out of it. I drove it five hours to Galveston for, 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 the, Rock, uh, for the Lone Star Rally. So, you know, some guys, they, they want to stay, keep their T-Rex in town and just, just cruise. I'll, I'll take mine across the state of Texas, you know? And he'll bank on the fact that it's reliable, huh? Yeah. So yeah, You can't beat that, man. You can't beat that, definitely. So, guys, look, let me know in the comment section below if this is indeed the most powerful. I think, I think, I think we can come to the conclusion that this is definitely the most powerful. Yeah, for sure. If this is the most powerful, but on top of that, also fastest T-Rex in the game. to hold the power. A lot of times people think you could just bolt a turbo on and go. And in a lot of cases, a lot of your street um, riding turbos are like that to a degree, but they have a limit. By him being able to set this turbo up in the manner that he set it up, you talk about totally ripping the motor apart and putting heavy duty components inside, man, to make it uh, stand up to the abuse, stand up to uh, the power that it's gonna take on. So, so let me know in the comment section below, guys. Is this the world's most powerful T-Rex in the game?
Unfortunately, I've been, I was involved in a nasty accident with my tractor trailer, and I was told I shouldn't be riding my motorcycle anymore. So I said, um, that ain't gonna happen, dog. So he said, uh, you can put screws and pins in your back and hold you together. I was like, no, that ain't gonna happen either. So I'm going to a specialist, but I said, can I get back on my bike? He goes, I wouldn't recommend it. I said, what if I get a three-wheeler? He goes, uh, like a slingshot? I was like, no, sir. <laughs> slingshot ain't gonna touch what I wanna get. So he goes, what would you wanna get? And I said, T-Rex. My following visit to the doctor, he says, you get a T-Rex, I'll be your doctor for the rest of the time. So I was like, I mean, I seen you guys riding last night, or no, not last night, the night before. And you guys were all coming over the, the bridge, and I was like, there's nobody out here with T-Rexes. I can't believe this. And all of a sudden, you guys came over the bridge, I'm like, I was already heading home, I was like, I'm not gonna double back. Just to watch these guys, so. It's nice seeing you guys set up here, this is really cool. They say this motherfucker right here, man, is faster than a spaceship, man. How oh, man? Oh, nice. I don't know. Ready, ready to take flight. They said it's ready to take flight at any given moment, man. We don't know. We don't know, Joey, man. Yeah. Hey, look, we're gonna upload it and we're gonna see what the other T Rex owners yeah. have to say about that. We're gonna have to do a link up and do a ride along or something. Yeah, ride along. We all take them out to a track or something like but that. I do take it road racing. I do drive the shit out of it. Yeah, so. man. It ain't, it ain't a, you know, it trailer, ain't a trailer queen. queen. Yeah. With the turbo setup, I got 12,000 miles on it. And it's still going, you know. Bud Allen's my fabricator. He owns uh, Boudrix in Texas. He talked me into doing the dry sump oil system for the turbo set setup, and I think that's what, you know, fix a lot of the cooling issues. So it'll it can idle all day and it won't overheat. Uh, 110 degree weather in Texas, and it was fine. So yeah, you'll build it right and right, drive the shit out of it.